Have you ever wondered about the power that lies beneath the Indian Ocean's waves, ready to strike back even after a catastrophic first attack? Today, we delve into the depths of India's defense capabilities, particularly its second strike prowess. At the heart of this strategy, we find the K-5 missile. It's not just a missile, but a symbol of India's determination to protect its sovereignty at all costs. The K-5 missile, a formidable weapon that is a game-changer for India's defense strategy. The K-5 missile, an underwater beast, boasts of impressive specifications. An integral part of India's nuclear command authority, the K-5 is a submarine-launched ballistic missile with an impressive range of over 3,100 miles. This formidable range allows it to target strategic locations deep within an adversary's territory. In terms of payload, the K-5 can carry between two to three tons, which further amplifies its strategic importance. This missile is designed to provide India with an enhanced second strike capability. This means even after an initial nuclear attack, India can retaliate with nuclear weapons, a critical component of the country's nuclear deterrence strategy. The K-5 is launched from India's Arihant-class nuclear-powered submarines. This not only provides a secure and stealthy platform for launching a retaliatory strike, but also enhances the missile's mobility and range. One of the key features of the K-5 is its solid fuel system. This makes the missile more reliable, easier to maintain and faster to launch compared to its liquid-fueled counterparts. The K-5 is also believed to be capable of carrying multiple warheads. This means it can target different locations simultaneously, thereby increasing its effectiveness as a deterrent. Furthermore, the missile is equipped with an advanced guidance system, enabling it to accurately target its intended destination. The inclusion of stealth technology in its design makes the K-5 difficult to detect and intercept by enemy defense systems. The K-5 is also reportedly capable of carrying multiple independently targetable re-entry vehicles or MIRVs. This allows it to target multiple locations with separate warheads, a feature that greatly enhances its strategic value. Additionally, the K-5's range and accuracy enable it to target an adversary's military assets such as missile silos, air bases, and command centers, making it a counterforce weapon. With these features, the K-5 missile is not just a weapon, it's a sophisticated piece of technology designed for maximum impact. The K-5 missile isn't just for offense, it's a critical part of India's defense strategy. You see, it's a crucial player in what's known as a second strike capability. This is a fundamental concept in nuclear strategy, which essentially refers to a country's ability to retaliate with nuclear weapons, even after suffering an initial nuclear attack. Now you might wonder, how does the K-5 missile fit into this strategy? Well, the K-5 is designed with this very purpose in mind. It's a submarine-launched ballistic missile, or SLBM, which means it's launched from submarines, specifically India's Arihant-class nuclear-powered submarines. This provides a secure and stealthy platform for launching a retaliatory strike. Submarines, by virtue of their ability to stay hidden beneath the ocean's surface, are much harder to detect and neutralize. This makes them the perfect platform for a second strike weapon like the K-5. Moreover, the K-5 uses solid fuel. This is a significant advantage because solid-fueled missiles are more reliable, easier to maintain and faster to launch compared to their liquid-fueled counterparts. In a high-stakes situation where every second counts, the ability to launch quickly and reliably can make all the difference. But the K-5's second strike capabilities aren't just about retaliation, they're also about deterrence. The knowledge that India has the ability to launch a devastating counterattack, even after an initial strike, serves to discourage potential adversaries from launching a nuclear attack in the first place. In essence, the K-5 missile, with its ability to be launched from submarines and its solid fuel advantage is a cornerstone of India's second strike capability. It's a potent reminder to any potential aggressors that a first strike won't go unanswered. The K-5 missile is India's strong answer to any first strike, ensuring that retaliation is always an option. The K-5 missile isn't just a piece of military hardware, it's a strategic asset that enhances India's nuclear deterrence. 
In the complex chess game of global defense strategy, the K-5 missile serves as a powerful piece on India's board. Its impressive range of over 5,000 kilometers, payload capacity of two to three tons, and ability to be launched from a submarine make it a formidable weapon. But beyond its technical prowess, the K-5's strategic significance plays a crucial role in India's defense strategy. India's nuclear doctrine is built on two pillars, credible minimum deterrence and a no first use policy. The K-5 missile with its enhanced second strike capability is a linchpin in this strategy. The credible minimum deterrence principle requires India to maintain a nuclear arsenal robust enough to deter any potential aggressors. The K-5, capable of carrying multiple warheads and targeting strategic locations deep within enemy territory serves as a potent deterrent. In the event of a nuclear attack on India, the K-5's second strike capability allows for retaliation even after an initial nuclear strike. This capability, in essence, ensures that any nuclear aggression against India would come at an unacceptable cost to the aggressor, thereby reinforcing deterrence. The no-first-use policy, on the other hand, is a commitment by India not to use nuclear weapons unless first attacked by an adversary using such weapons. Here again, the K-5's role is vital. By providing a secure and reliable means of retaliation, the K-5 ensures that India can adhere to its no-first-use policy without compromising its ability to respond to nuclear aggression. In addition to these, the K-5's advanced guidance system, stealth technology, and counterforce capability enable it to target an adversary's military assets with precision, further enhancing its strategic value. The K-5 missile, therefore, plays a critical role in maintaining the balance of power and ensuring peace and stability in the region. The K-5 missile is undeniably a significant addition to India's defense arsenal. This submarine-launched ballistic missile, with its impressive range and payload capacity, not only enhances India's second strike capabilities, but also underscores its nuclear deterrence strategy. Its solid fuel design, advanced guidance system, stealth technology, and multiple warhead capability make it a formidable force. Integrated with India's Nuclear Command Authority, the K-5 missile is a key component of India's defense strategy. The K-5 missile, a silent sentinel beneath the waves, stands as a testament to India's commitment to peace